Can you believe you can cook a soup in an air fryer? I'm about to show you how to cook my Thai salmon noodle soup in the air fryer. It's a recipe from my cookbook, The Ultimate Air Fryer Cookbook, One Basket Meals. You can do it all, all in one basket in the air fryer. For this recipe, I'm going to use my dual air fryer. Um, each recipe in the book you can adapt to any air fryer. So if you want to half the ingredients if you have uh, a smaller air fryer, or with this one, we're going to put half the ingredients in that side and half the ingredients in that side. But we're going to remove the crisper trays first. So we've removed our crisper plate, we're going to pop the salmon directly into our air fry baskets. Spray lightly with a little bit of olive oil. We're going to pop them on to cook for eight minutes. Yeah. So I'm going to pop in my crushed lemongrass. I'm going to go in with my ginger paste. Remember we're popping half each and then we're going to go in with our Thai red curry paste. We'll pop in in half each. And then finally with our pak choy. Snugly either side. Each with our stock. Pouring over, paste in the middle. And over our pack choy. And then finally with our coconut milk. I'm going to pop that in for five minutes, giving it a little stir halfway. Now it's time to add in your rice noodles and stir well. So don't forget to open your drawer of your air fryer anytime you want to. Give it a bit of a stir. Try and get those noodles mixed in with the lovely liquids that you've got in there because it soaks up all the delicious flavours. When serving, don't forget to remove your lemongrass stalks from the soup. They're a little bit chewy. You don't want them in your soup. Serve your soup sprinkled with some fresh coriander and if you like it hot, add some red chilli slices too.